welcome back to my channel today. Um, I just have a couple things I want to say. Uh, here I'm prepping the canvas so that uh, the design does not flow off of the canvas because of that super thin base paint. It'll help your design stick to the, to the sides. Also, I wanted to talk about leveling your canvas. Uh, it's super important to level, otherwise you'll lose your design off one corner or another. So here you'll see me leveling uh, the canvas. Now consistency. Uh, I get the most questions about consistency, so I slowed it down here. The consistency of your base coat needs to be very, very fluid. In fact, you don't want to, when you pull that popsicle stick an inch above the rim or the, the top of your paint, you do not want to see any triangle, any trace, you want it to sink right away. So I just wanted to address that because that seems to be an issue with a lot of people in this technique. Uh, they're having difficulties getting the right consistency. So I wanted to show that to you. So yeah, the, the rest of this is just the normal. Um, here I'm gonna lay my base coat. I am going to add the puddle paints. I'm gonna let that sit for about 10 minutes to see where the pearl cells are going to pop up and then I'm going to determine what what I want to do and where I want to go with the Dutch pour portion. So thank you guys all for being here. If you like what you see, please uh, consider subscribing, like, uh, put a thumbs up on this video, share it with anybody on your social medias or anybody who you think might benefit from this. Um, and as well hit that notification bell so you get notified each time I put out a new video. And of course, as usual, please go over to my dad's channel, DJ Fluid Arts. He's got some really cool swipes with the masking tape and the pearl cell technique, uh, his own twist on it. So go on over there and check him out. All right, guys, I'm going to let you go now. Thank you so much for being here again and have a great, great day. Thank you.